times here in Franklin County uh, during our convention and several of our monthly meetings. Uh, we have monthly meetings the second Thursday of every month on Nash Street, just next door to the old theater. You're welcome to come anytime. But Deborah Golden, she is also a Wake County School Board member. She also has given and given and given for the children of Wake County for the public education. At this time, please welcome Deborah to the stage. Thank you. Thank you. I am Deborah Goldman, and I would like to be your next state auditor. Many of you don't really know what the auditor is supposed to do because our current one isn't doing what the state auditor has been told to do by you, the people of North Carolina. The state auditor's role is a chief investigatory role. I don't know about you, and maybe I should ask, have you had enough fraud in North Carolina? Have you had enough corruption in North Carolina? Have you had enough bureaucracy, cronyism, malfeasance, waste in North Carolina? Now is the time. By electing me as your state auditor, along with the rest of our Republican Conservative Council of State team, now is the time this fall that North Carolina government can be tra transformed and we can go back to the way the Constitution describes the way government is to be run. Pretty key time in North Carolina history. You heard my friend John talking about a team. It is a council of state team. You get to hear from a few of us tonight, but we all need your help. You are the key. I intend to get in there and be elected by the people to serve you, the people. Your tax dollars, your say. Tend to be the, the trend in North Carolina over the last four years Heck, the, the trend in North Carolina for a long time has been downhill and questionable. It is about time that we had some fiscal responsibility in this state. So with that, what I will ask you is to please, all of you that are out here, you're out here because you're fired up. You're out here because you understand what we're trying to do. You believe, you support, you're with us. These are all key things going forward. It takes a lot of strength and a lot of courage to run for a council of state position. We are out here running every corner of North Carolina. It's nice to be kind of close to home tonight. I'm a mom of three. It's nice for my kids to see me on occasion as this campaign season really heats up. And as we've got, what do we have, 24 days left? Things are going to get pretty ugly. John gave you a math problem. I want to talk a few numbers with you too. The auditor that you currently have in North Carolina thinks that it is okay, thinks that if she finds fraud, that she needs to figure out if it's legal or not. I don't know, I heard a few chuckles. I don't know about you, but fraud by definition is illegal. It's about time that it stops. Your current state auditor thinks that as long as she's doing an audit of the books for an entity in North Carolina, that if it is within plus or minus $500 million, that that is within her industry standard. I want you to know that is not my industry standard. So you are in for a new way to have the auditor's office run. I intend to be in there. I intend to dig. Somebody asked me the other day, if I had my shovel ready to get in there and start digging, and I said, I think I could find enough fraud with a plastic spoon. So I ask your help. It is you, the people, that we need. Everything that you do, whether you're putting out a yard sign, working on a pole, making a phone call, calling your friends, talking to someone in the grocery store, please take some of our cards and stickers. Wear them as you're shopping. Because every time someone sees that name on a sticker that gets that little piece of name ID, when they get into the poll, if they have a brief second where they're not sure, they're going to go with the name that is familiar. If you have friends, family, 
any kind of listserv, email, whatever across the state, you need to get our names out, please. I'm asking for your help, and most importantly, I'm asking for your prayers. Because going forward, this is a time, I mentioned courage, it's also a time of great faith, and we are working hard, praying a lot, working more, and praying some more. So please stay with us. We've got 24 more days to go. We need every ounce of strength that you can give. Thank you. And again, I'm Deborah Goldman, your next state auditor. Thank you.